Disney Straven and today I'm having a um, simple eyeshadow, like a smoky, like orangey eyeshadow makeup tutorial, something for fall. Um, also pair it up with a dark purple lip. Um, so yeah, so I actually had originally done this makeup a while back recently and I posted a selfie on my story and then some people had, did request for another request, they liked it a lot and I said I was going to do a makeup tutorial for that and they seemed to like the idea a lot so here we are. Um, I used yellow and orange eyeshadows. Um, from Baby Bat Beauty and Kat Von D. I'm not, I think that's all I use. I can't remember exactly what I to use, but I'm gonna try to get as close to the original look as possible. So yeah. Okay, so first, um, we're gonna be using this yellow shade called Doomsday from Baby Bat Beauty, and I mean, here it is. It's just a, it's like a really pretty musty yellow. I think this is one of the my most favorite shades that they had sent me a while back. Um, I do have a discount code for you guys, it's Denise underscore Draven, I'll put it down below in the, in the description box and also a link to their website, you can buy much pretty eyeshadows of these, I'm also using one of the other shades in a bit, um, but you can buy eyeshadows like these from them, they also have really good liquid lipsticks, I currently don't own any, but I've had friends tell me that they have they have like gotten some from, from them before in the past and they really did like them, so I might order a lipstick in, like pretty soon, so that way I can have some more products to promote, but for now they sent me some eyeshadows, so yeah, so I, I'm be starting this off. I'm be starting. I'm be using this color to off the look. Um, I guess I'm gonna use this as a transition color, so you don't want to get too much on a brush. I might go in a little bit more later, maybe like a more smaller compacted brush. Um, to get more closer to the crease, I guess. Um, we're also gonna be using some more shades after this. But first, I'm gonna be dipping a brush into this, and it does have quite a bit of fallout, so don't you gotta be careful. But or not, it's really pigmented and it's a really good eyeshadow. I think I should definitely check these out. I really do love their matte eyeshadows. So yeah, so we're just gonna apply this all over the crease. Not like all over the crease, but like maybe like on the outer crease and blend it out. And I'm gonna try to get as close to my original look as possible. It was kind of it was kind of like a winged out smoky eye, so that's what we're gonna try to do. Kat Von D Satan Cinder Palette. I'm gonna be diving into the shade Devil Next. I think I'd actually use Martyr first, my original look, but Martyr is a little more of a brownie orange. So this was more of a bright orange. So we're gonna dip into that one first, and then we're probably gonna dip into Martyr next. I mean, I'll, I'll just tell you guys when I'm gonna do it next. Um, we're gonna be using a smaller blending brush, um, and then we're gonna blend it out. And also, I might grab my other bigger blending brush, it gets more fluffier, and then blend it out some more of that. Saint and Center palette again, and we're gonna be jumping into the shade Martyr, which is more of like a burnt orange looking shade. So we're gonna dip into that. We're gonna be using a smaller crease brush, um, and then we're gonna be blending it out with the with the with this Elf blending brush. It's kind of like kind of small, so yeah. Blunderbuss from Baby Bat Beauty and it is kind of like a copper brown like it's not like a dark brown it's really pretty it's almost like a reddish brown and I really like it I think it goes really well with this look it goes with the fall tones I guess and I think this is from their steampunk eyeshadow collection the two eyeshadows I've been using I think they're from their steampunk eyeshadow collection 
Um, again, I have I do have a discount code for Baby Abby Cosmetics. So remind you guys, Denise underscore Denise underscore Javen. Um, I'll leave a discount code about down below in my description box and the link to my website. So yeah, so we're gonna be applying this kind of on the crease. I'm trying to think how I did it in my original one. Let me look at the let me pull up a picture quick. Um, we're gonna keep it more on the outer crease. We're not really gonna drag it all the way over here. Um, I'm gonna kind of bring it up more up here. A little bit up into this crease right here, but then we're gonna stop right there. And yeah, so I'm gonna kind of keep it more towards the other crease and blend it out. Diving back into the Kat Von D palette and let me jumping right into the shade Martyr. Let me do the under eyes now and I'm gonna get a small face brush. If you guys have any like smaller brushes, that would work too. And I'm playing it underneath the eye and blending it out. Blunderbuss again from Baby Bat Beauty and we're using the same small brush again and we're kind of go back in there but we're not, we're not going to blend it out as much as we did the first orange shade that we just put on. Satan Center palette again. This time we using the shade Amen right here. It's kind of like a real near it's not white completely, it's kind of like a tinted white. I don't, I don't know, like kind of like a tannish, like palish. I don't know how to explain it. But yeah, it's a really like color. It's not white, but it's kind of close to white, so I don't know how to explain it. But um we're gonna be using a flat eyeshadow brush and reapplying it kind of like on the crease. We're not gonna be doing a crease, it's just gonna be like a soft crease today. Cap on these metal matte palette, and we're gonna be dipping into the shade Flash. It's kind of like a yellowish metallic shade, like kind of like a goldy yellow. So, yeah, so I'm gonna dip my finger into it. I feel like shimmer shades come out better when you apply it with the finger, and I'm just gonna apply it right onto the center of the crease and just pet it out. I like blend it out the finger a little bit, so yeah, and that's how, that's how I'm gonna apply it. Next, I'm gonna be using Kat Von D's Basket Case Liner, and I have very little of it. Like a little, that's all, that's all that's gonna come out. But we still have a little bit in there, so we're just gonna try to use as much as we can. Try to put it in my waterline. I'm gonna try not to get it like all smudgy and gross. If not, then we'll just kind of blend it out a little bit with the brush. I mean, some black isn't too bad, right? But um, so yeah, so we're gonna be applying this onto my waterlines. wing liner so with that we're going to be using Kat Von D's tattoo liner and I'm just doing a simple wing and I'm also going to put some on the inner corner kind of like wing out the inner corner a little bit as well
important part and that is eyebrows. So I'm using Kat Von D's Eyebrow Pomade and Graphite. That's the one I use. Of course you can use whatever eyebrow color you would like to. Whatever nat matches your natural hair color, your current hair color. So yeah. So we're going to be using a small angled brush and we're going to be applying this onto my eyebrows. some eyelashes and today I'm applying some Alien Cosmetics 626 lashes um I love this I think I showed these in the Alien Cosmetics um palette review test first impressions or whatever um the makeup for all I think that's, that's, um, it'll come up for this one but um so yeah so these ones are 626 they're really pretty they're fluffy um they also have a blue shine in them and I think these are really pretty and I've used different I'd use different lashes for the first look that I did for Instagram but um, I just got these recently and I can't really dry them, so we're gonna put these on for this look. Okay, so next we're gonna be applying Kat Von D Standard Liquid Lipstick. It's just like a really dark purple. You can use whatever dark purple lipstick you have, or you can find. So, yeah. So that will be it for today's makeup tutorial. It was just, I want to do something easy and fun to do, so, whew, sorry. Um, I think this is a really simple look. It's kind of like a smoky orange eyeshadow, kind of have a little highlight in the crease. Now that it's like a cut crease, I always do cut creases, so this is a little break from cut creases, a tiny bit. It's just a little soft crease. Um, I think it's perfect for fall, and I want to film it now before I take off to school. I don't know if I'll be filming while I'm in school, so, so yeah. Um, and also I think the orange and purple goes really, it goes really beautifully together. Like, I think it's just perfect. It's just, it's like a perfect fall color, to be honest. Like, I really love it. Where I live, we don't really get much of a fall because it's always hot as hell. Like, we don't get fall until, like, maybe December. And December is not really cold at all. We get winter till, like, January, February, maybe? It depends. Yeah, it's horrible. Um, so yeah, so... Hopefully y'all guys will enjoy fall without me. <laughs> Whatever. Um, that's because fall is actually my favorite season. Like, it's nice and cool. It's not too hot. It's not too cold. The weather's perfect. You know, I can go up with straight hair and be fine. My makeup will be good. I can wear whatever I want. I can wear, like, a long skirt and, like, long sleeves. You know, I can just wear, like, whatever the heck I want. Um, the heat, I can't really wear much. I have to wear, like, shorts and a t-shirt and that's it. Like, it gets super hot. And if I want to style it up, that I just suffer, you know? <laughs> but whatever. Um, I guess that's how... I guess gobs are pretty brave at facing the heat, I guess. Especially here in South Texas. But yeah. Um, so yeah, so I think this is a simple look. I really do like how it came out. Um, it's a little bit different than the one I did originally for Instagram. Um, but actually, I think this look... I think this looks better. Usually when I do like makeup looks, the second time always comes out better because I already know what I'm doing. Um, I, I spend more time with the blending and everything. So yeah. Um... So yes, I guess that's, that's all for today. So make sure you follow me on Instagram and Twitter. Um, I'm always posting sneak peeks on YouTube videos and my Instagram stories. And I always post makeup looks that don't go up on YouTube and stuff. Um, you guys can, of course, request them so that way I can later on film them and post them up on YouTube. Um, what else am I going to say? Also, be sure to check out babybatbeauty.com. Um, my discount code is Denise Draven. Denise underscore Draven. Um, I'll, put, I'll put the link down below on my discount codes so always check it out and that's because I already have like some like the makeup isn't like really that expensive it's really good I really do like the eyeshadows I mean look how look how they blend they blended so beautifully honestly look at that I, I'm in love like the yellow looks so good um definitely pick up those eyeshadows they're only like five dollars each plus you get discounts so that's pretty cool they also have really pretty lipsticks um they have lip balm they have all kinds of like products on their website they have glitter I think they have loose and pressed glitter um, they have like a bunch of different stuff, so make sure you check them out, check them out, make sure you follow them on Instagram, and also be sure to check out aliencosmetics.com, they have a bunch of really pretty lashes, and they actually did release the eyeshadow palette recently, and I actually did put a makeup tutorial for that, so maybe, we'll, maybe I'll leave a link down below, so you know, always, so that way you guys can check it out, and they have like a bunch of, they have makeup brushes, and they have eyelashes, and they have lipsticks, and they have like a bunch of like, 
stuff coming out and that, I think they are releasing a palette in the fall I don't know if they've released it by now now that the video is up I'm pretty sure I'm posting it in September um, I don't know when they release it but I'm really excited so yeah um, so that will be it for today's makeup tutorial so I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did so make sure to leave a like and comment down below and also be sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet bye guys <laughs>